outside the ruins of Sakzaiwama, just a mile and a half from the Korikancha Temple in Cusco, are little known entrances to underground passageways dating back to the Inca. Many of the openings have been covered up and sealed for public safety, but a few still remain accessible. In 2017, David Childress visited the site of one of the remaining open tunnels. There is a labyrinth of tunnels beneath Cusco, and they extend for hundreds of miles in every direction. And some of these tunnels even intersect. Over the years, these tunnels have been blocked off and sealed, but you can still access parts of this tunnel system, such as this tunnel here, cut through solid rock. Local legend says that the sun disk was transported out of the city through these tunnels. There's been a lot of speculation of where the sun disk was taken, and treasure hunters have been searching for this location for centuries. Legends recount three myths as to how the sacred golden sun disk left Cusco. Some legends maintain that it was taken out through a tunnel system to Gran Patiti, a lost Inca village at the top of a mountain which the Spanish never ever found. Some maintain it was taken to Saxe Woman. And some maintain it was returned to Lake Titicaca, from whence it came. Located more than 200 miles southeast of Cusco, at an elevation of over 12,500 feet above sea level, Titicaca is the highest navigable lake in the world and considered sacred to the local Andean population. In the Incan creation myth, their god Viracocha emerged from Lake Titicaca. This goes along with ancient myths and legends that tell us that there's an etheric or ethereal city that's underneath Lake Titicaca. In light of this, it makes sense that the Incas returned their prized golden disc to the lake. The temple was said to be a thing of imagination, a thing of wonder, until the year 2000. In the year 2000, a team of Italian divers and scientists ventured to the base of Lake Titicaca after finding a road of Inca stones. They followed the road for just less than half a mile into the lake and discovered a 650 by 150 foot temple underneath the waters of Lake Titicaca.